Hi, hello. I've never done a Q&A, so today we are changing that. I'm doing my makeup whilst I answer these questions because I'm meeting with my friends supposedly in a few hours because we're very disorganised. Okay, Esther asks, what is your fave TV programme and fave film? Um, TV programme? Doctor Who, all the way. Obviously, I really fucking love Orange is the New Black right now. I've cried so much. With the ending of season four, you have no- I don't cry with, like, films because it's only two hours. If you give me four seasons and 13 episodes in each of those, my god, it is torture for me that I cry so much at the end. But Doctor Who is always going to be my all-time favourite. Also Sherlock, like, I love Sherlock, but I, it's hard to consider that a series because it comes out so often and the episodes are so weird and- And, uh, fake film. Uh, probably Scott Pilgrim vs. The World. I'm gonna colour correct a bit with this weird thing because I don't know, my face is looking a bit red but we'll just we'll just go along with it. Okay, Izzy asks, if you could play any part in Satan's Scrotum, who would you play? Um, Izzy, I would obviously play Luke or um the mother because I feel well not the mother the wife I feel like I relate to her a lot she's got a lot going on I get stressed about 50 50 bread you know if I get that whole grain instead of 50 50 I don't know what to do with my life so I really do relate to her I feel like I could really work with the character you know loves stuff by jazz on twitter asks who do you think what I am I don't fucking know if I if I knew that if I could answer that question my life would be a lot less mysterious, wouldn't it? So let's keep that mystery in place. Oh my god, my skin is so dry. How is that possible? Just ask who one who's what's your favourite album right now? Oh god, that's a hard question. Um I'm listening to the nineteen seventy five a lot, even though when the album came out, as in the new one, um I was into it but I didn't really like have time to like really get into it. I'm helping my dad like renovate a flat that we own so I've got a lot of time where I'm just like painting walls for three hours straight and you've got a lot of time to yourself so like I really like listening to that album and just like contemplating life in general. I'm also listening to Vessel a lot as in by 21 Pilots and um oh my god what's the album called? Brand New Eyes by Paramore? It's a really weird combination I've just realised. Uh, Jas also asked, what's something you miss about being younger? Oh, uh, I think like the innocence, like I don't, this, not in like some weird creepy way, but just like the naiveness that you have when you're a kid is bliss. The world was a lot simpler then and it didn't feel like there was as much evil and I guess in some ways you knew, but like, I don't know. It's something that I do like about being older, like knowing more stuff and knowing more about the world, but it's something that goes hand in hand with just all the negativity that there is and just oh, all the shit there is about being a teenager. Oh, don't I sound stereotypical as fuck. <laughs> okay, we're done with that colour correcting dough. Alright. Okay, um, I use two colours of foundation because I'm really, really, like, unproportionately coloured. I'm wearing shorts today and I don't really know what to do about it because my legs are stupidly pale compared to, like, just this one bit of my arm but then, like, my arm compared to my face is completely like tan and I don't know. I'm thinking of getting a beauty blender. I don't know whether like anybody cares. I don't know if anybody has any comments on that. Please do leave some give opinions. Emma asks as an editing goes to be honest, uh favorite fictional character. Oh, you've really got me there. I don't know that. Okay, Helly asks Three questions, that's long. Okay, uh, fave book. Oh god, like right now, um, Reasons to Stay Alive by Matt, by Matt Haig. Okay, that's the foundation now. Let's powder this shit up, because I am very oily, but also very dry. See, oh god, I love teenage skin. I love Accutane and what it does to you when you're off it. Um, <laughs> Favourite movie when you were younger? I loved the Barbie films, as stereotypical as that is. And even now, yeah, the plot is a bit confusing. But my god, were they done well. Uh, the 12 Dancing Princesses, let me just say, that like river of gold that was under their house, that was like my dream come true. Ellie, I didn't finish answering her question, so... Um, unlimited Lush products for two years, but you don't get to buy any new clothes for that time, will you press the button? Um, I was thinking about this and I was like, hell no, because I love clothes and honestly, I don't buy that much in Lush anyway, but then I realised I don't buy in Lush because it's expensive. If I get free stuff for two years, firstly, I will be like 
soft and beautiful head to toe. For the good of my health, maybe, yeah, I think I would. <laughs> um, Aaron asks, uh, what was your first pet's name and if you haven't ever had a pet, what would it be called and why? Um, I've only ever had goldfish because I am extremely allergic to everything. Really allergic to like cats and dogs, which is sad because I love dogs. Okay, don't kill me, but I'm really not that much of a cat person. They're cute, they're really cute, but the, most of the cats I've met absolutely hate me. And then also I die next to them. I'm not as allergic to dogs, but my first pet was a goldfish. We had like, th we always had three at a time. Um, and the first one technically wasn't mine, it was my brother's and it was called Garfield. And we didn't give it this name for a while, but we gave Garfield his <laughs> legend legendary name when uh, he ate all the other fish's food, and that's mainly why all of them died. Nat, Nat on, uh, Nat on a adventure. No, Nat on adventure. I thought it was Nat on a adventure. Oh, well that changes things. Um, they ask, uh, what's the best ice cream flavor? Salted caramel ice cream from Harkin does. Um, Joe asks again three questions. Uh, favorite word. Favorite song at the moment. I don't know really. If you guys have any recommendations, then like hit me up. Oh, unpopular opinion. Oh, Joe, why did you do this to me? Um, unpopular opinion. Yeah, I mean I don't like cats. I don't know. God, Joe. See, you ask really good questions, and I can't really like answer quickly. <laughs> God. I'll come back later, I'll see if I can think of something. Okay, eyebrows are kind of dull. They never really look, oh god, they look so different. They are not similar in the slightest. Okay, well, we're doing eyeshadow now. I don't have my eyeshadow, I'm gonna get it back. Zoe, the alpha pool, my fave person in that world. Uh, any weird habits? Probably, I can't really think of anything right now. Um, I have a tendency to pick out the skin of my fingers. Okay, there are just stains where your makeup looks uh, amazing and wonderful and it's super easy to do. Today is not one of those days for me. It's like, you know, with your eyeliner that you just have random days where like it goes really fucking well and you're like, oh damn, I should do this more often and you do it the next day and my lordy, does it not look as good as it did? Um, that's essentially what's happening to me right now. Okay, I've kind of run out of questions, that's sad. But after Zoe, Zoe, you're the last one, nice. Um, when are you coming over soon? <laughs> you just, you just wait and see. Zoe, last question, what are your fave ships? Oh god, I can't remember the last time I actually like, actively shipped anything. Um, um, I like to call this look, somebody threw a frying pan at me, so not only did I get burnt, but I got all the oil on my face too. It's a working title, but I think it works. Yeah, thanks to everyone who asked questions, and I don't know when I'll upload this, but I'll see you guys whenever I see you guys. <laughs> Alright, bye.